सो हेलो गाइस दिस इज हनी एंड वंस अगेन आई वेलकम यू ऑन माय यूट्यूब चैनल इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू हाउ टू सॉल्व द आर्ट्स रीडिंग टेस्ट वेल गाइस आई मेड दिस वीडियो ऑन द डिमांड ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स मोस्टली स्टूडेंट्स आर इन अ डाउट दैट हाउ टू अटेम्प्ट द आर्ट्स रीडिंग Guys, let me tell you. First of all, whenever you open any IELTS reading test, the initial thing that you guys are going to do, you must read the title of the passage. If the passage has any subtitle, you can read the title or the subtitle of the passage to boost. After reading the title or subtitle, now you need to take a look at the questions which are given in the section like one to thirteen. All the questions are given, so you are going to take a look at the questions from one to thirteen. You have to see what type of questions are there. If there are like uh, sentence completion questions and uh, two false not given, along with the, what they have got in a paragraph contains like the following, you need to see which question type is easiest for you and do not start attempting these questions. All the questions like from one to five, then six to ten. After that, pending eleven to thirteen. No, you just have to see. Okay. Fill in the blanks are easier for me, and fill in the blanks are given like in the form question of 11 to 13 or uh, 9 to 13. So I commence with fill in the blanks first. Okay. Subsequently, if you find any question type like true false not given, because in all completion type of questions are in uh, true false not given questions and in passes, they are in the same order. So what you have to do, you need to start with these type of questions. There are some questions. like where you need better understanding of the passage like which paragraph contains the following information and the questions like matching these questions need deeper understanding of the passage so you can always do them at the end do not try to start with these questions i mean as they have given questions 1 to 5 those 1 to 5 questions are which paragraph contains the following information okay so this question will drain your brain and after that's when you come to easy question your brain will not support you your mind will not assist you and you feel that very horrible so guys you should always see the number 2 and the next point is actually you must follow the time the timeline actually when you are doing your reading test for the first section try to complete it in a 15 minutes and you guys as you know doing it should be in a hurry sometimes you know that if you are getting late for something you are in a hurry so you should be in a hurry when you are actual doing all reading one section section 1 is over come to the section 2 first of all reading the titles of the passages if you feel comfortable you can read the first line of every paragraph if the passage has headings quickly skim through those headings as well as once you read the passages you need to switch on your imagination okay this passage is about human life all right this passage is about the history of chocolates okay this passage is about the scientific experiments and all that do you should just visualize the passage then you can understand now in part 2 of all reading again go through the questions and see what type of question is easier for me always try to solve the completion type of questions then short answer question where you have to find the one word more than two words and more than three words or a number where you go to find the words always try to start with this type of questions then you know better which type is is it for you and on the other side which is difficult for you so you can just decide and for section 2 i would advise you to spend just 20 minutes and for section 1 you can spend 15 minutes and 20 minutes on section 3 you must make yourself time bound if 20 minute time is over immediately in the last 2 3 minutes do the answers do the questions then move on section 3 now will you will do the same thing in the section 3 as earlier said just read the titles and subtitles then switch on your imagination so guys this is all about the reading test how you can solve the full reading test with enough time i hope this video is informative for you and is like share and comment thank you